Hi ladies, I'm Sandra, your body fit trainer, and today we are going to be doing my first video of my sexy superset series, Luscious Legs. All you're going to need are some dumbbells and the cheek grip bar if you have one. Uh, make sure you do your three to five minute warm up before starting any of my exercises and always have a water nearby so you stay well hydrated. All right, ladies, get your stuff ready and let's do this. For this workout, we're going to be doing two supersets. Each superset will consist of four exercises and I'd like you to shoot for three rounds of each superset. There'll be a 60 second rest between rounds. All right, we're gonna start with reverse lunges. So you should have your dumbbells ready. We're gonna take a little step forward. You're gonna look straight ahead. Keep those shoulders back, tighten up that core, tighten up those glutes. Keep looking straight ahead. Bring that foot all the way back, stay up on that toe and drop that knee and bring it forward and again tighten everything up and then you're going to bring the other leg back drop that knee and bring it back up again you're just dropping that back knee and then squeeze and then back again and squeeze that knee should not be coming too far forward and squeeze everything no resting on the floor with that knee and squeeze that six and drop it down and seven and eight, that shin should stay as parallel as possible. That's nine, 10, I'm gonna go for 12 on these, 11, and one more, so we're even on each side, and 12. Okay, excellent. Next exercise, we're gonna be doing goblet squats. This exercise, a goblet squat, we're gonna put a little twist on it though. So you wanna bring that weight up nice and high, underneath your palms, bring your fingers across the top and you want those feet a good shoulder width apart again everything your back is straight shoulders are back glutes are tight and what you're going to do is drop it down sit it all the way back come back up and now we're going to bring one knee up that's my twist sit it all the way back come back up squeeze those glutes nice and tight and drive that other knee up and down it goes we're going to shoot for 10 I'd like for you to do anywhere between 10 and 15, depending on your level of fitness. Drop it back and raise that opposite knee and sit it back. And again, bring that knee, bring that knee up, sit it down, bring that knee up. Very important, I want you to stay looking forward, straight ahead, just like I am. I'm not looking at you right now. You wanna always keep your neck in line with your back. Center yourself back down, come up, raise that other knee. And I'm not sure what our count is right here, but I'm gonna go for two more. Sit it back, bring it up, keep everything nice and tight. You never wanna compromise your form. And that's it. Remember, we have three rounds of these. Next exercise, we're gonna move right into it. All right, our next two exercises are going to be single leg deadlifts. And with that, I would love if you have a T grip bar to use that. Otherwise, you can use some dumbbells, just two dumbbells in each hand, this, just like this. And we're gonna be doing the right leg first and then the left leg. So again, you want those feet shoulder width apart, keep that weight in your heels. Look straight ahead, shoulders back, everything nice and tight. And bring that leg back and come back to the center and squeeze everything nice and tight. You want to really want to work on balance. As you can tell, mine is a little off. <laughs> and bring everything back and nice and tight. There we go. And squeeze. Keep everything tight. And squeeze. Keep those shoulders back. Let those arms just drop in front of you. Don't try to lift the weights. But you want to keep those shoulders back. And you want to keep that back straight. Okay. Let's go for six. Four more. And seven, eight, and nine. One more, squeeze those glutes when you come up to the top. And 10, beautiful. We're going right into that left leg. Hold on to that weight, nice and tight, shoulders back. Inhale, and exhale. I step away from the couch. Inhale, and exhale. Keep that back nice and straight. Keep those shoulders back. They should always be rolled back. Bring that leg down. You should really be looking down at the ground. 
and then looking straight ahead. And now just with your eyes. Four. There we go. We got five. These are excellent for the glutes and the hamstrings and your lower back. Six and balance. Seven, and it's hard to do when you're talking. <laughs> eight, two more. Nine, whoops, eight. It's hard to do when you're talking. One more. <laughs> and 10. Remember, ladies, I've been off for a while, so we're doing this together. Okay, now you're gonna rest for 60 seconds, and I want you to do those same four exercises in a row all over again for two more rounds. I'd like to see you shoot for those two more rounds. That's three rounds total. If you're advanced, increase your weight, go for more rounds. All right, and we're gonna be starting our second superset. So take that 60 second rest and let's get right to it. Okay, the first exercise in our next superset are going to be split squats. So again, grab your dumbbells. You're gonna stand off to the side, step forward. Very similar to a reverse lunge, only this time we're going to stay all the way back, just like this. We got the right leg back, you're up on that toe. Drop that knee, not all the way to the floor. Again, keep that shin nice and straight. Looking forward and bring it up. That's one, and you're gonna come right back down again. Staying in that position, keep those shoulders back. That's three, excellent, four. Squeeze everything, squeeze those glutes. That's five, you're gonna feel these, that's six. And we've got seven, inhale down, exhale up, eight, nine, and last one, 10, and we're gonna go right for that other foot, that other leg, bring that all the way back up on your toe. Okay, keep that weight in the heel on the forward foot, drop it down, exhale, that's one, inhale down, two, exhale up, three, four, five, always look forward, six, down to the side like me, seven, eight, nine, be careful not to bring that knee too far forward like I just did, and 10. Excellent, keep your focus. Okay, Our next exercise is going to be a straight leg deadlift. Again, another one of them that I love. So again, if you have your T grip bar, that's excellent. Otherwise, grab some dumbbells, I'm standing again off to the side, shoulders back, shoulders are always back. Tighten up that core and tighten up those glutes. The legs are straight, but they're not totally locked out. You want a little bit of a bend in the knee, okay? Keep those shoulders back and you're going to bring, oh, we're not doing those. <laughs> we're gonna bring up the one leg. Okay, and we're going to bring that weight down Look down at the ground as you're coming down. Keep that weight nice and close, as close to you as you can to your shoelaces. And bring it all the way up and roll those shoulders back. Inhale, come down. Exhale, drive those shoulders back. Inhale, bring it up. Squeeze everything. When you get up to the top, I want those glutes squeezed hard. Squeeze those abs, drop those shoulders back. And five, keep that back straight. Those shoulders should never drop forward like this. That's gonna round your back, that's very bad. Seven, keep going, inhale, exhale. Drive it back, drop it up. Eight, keep going, keep that weight in your heels. Nine, just like a squat. And 10, let's go for two more. Inhale down, drop those shoulders. And last one, excellent. All right, one more to go. This last exercise is one of my favorites. It's going to be a plie squat. And we're gonna, again, we're gonna throw a little twist into it. So you can use your dumbbell just like this, or I'm gonna go for my power blocks because I can get a little more weight on those. And I'd like to use a little more weight. I need to start using some more weight. Get those feet nice and wide. Point those toes out, not too far. We don't want them completely sideways. Okay, about a 45 degree angle. Keep those shoulders back, push that chest out. Tighten up those glutes in that core. Same thing applies. Inhale, come down, exhale, drive it up. Now for the twist. Down, inhale, 
We're gonna do three pulses. One, two, three. Exhale, drive it up. Inhale down. One, two, three, and drive it up. Inhale. One, two, three. Drive it up. Perfect. Keep going. Two, three. Drive it up. If you can't get down as far as I can, then you can only come down a little bit. That's fine. That's why your warm up is very important and stretching. Drive it up. One, two, three. Exhale. Get those shoulders back when you come up. Get your form. Center yourself. One, two, three. Drive it up. You can definitely move a little faster once your form is in line. And let's do two more. And exhale. And last one. One, two, three. Beautiful. All right. That is the last super set. You finish that last super set. Again, you want to rest for 60 seconds and again, shoot for those three rounds. So you're going to repeat those same four exercises again with no rest. Rest for 60 seconds and one more round. Well, I hope you enjoyed this Luscious Legs workout that I had for you today. Please give it a try and let me know what you think. Leave a thumbs up if you liked it or your comments below and let me know what you think. All right, see you back here soon. Remember, stay body fit.